Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, what a gig. <laughs> that that's an that's a depiction of the gig. Oh my gosh. It's 1040 at night. Okay. <laughs> so first off, I was supposed to uh, play for four hours here tonight. That's a long gig. Making less than I really wanted to. Now granted, I say that with a grain of salt in the sense that like, it's still way more than I would have made ever like three, four years ago. But then again, inflation's here and also I'm in a totally different place in my career, right? Put that all and said, I get, I'm rushing to the gig being, I'm like late, I'm running late. Just because like I was trying to print things up. Actually, this is uh, this this is how the thing came out. The uh, that tip jar thing. It came out actually really cool. I'm I'm happy with it. But it took forever to print. Way longer than I expected. Um, and just like and I had to eat dinner and just things just ran late. It's all good. Like life life happens, right? But I was running late. Get to the gate. I have like eight minutes to set up. Doesn't set up in that fast. But then like they put me in the strangest part of the restaurant. Like almost pretty much like by the front door where you people walk in they kind of have to turn a quarter i'm like in that area and like i'm 100 percent in the way and i recognize i'm 100 percent in the way but that's where they told me to go so i'm like okay so like i'm trying to fit all my gear like there's no way this is happening i'm like people are walking in i'm having to move my guitar every time like people walk it's a nightmare so these they come up to me after 20 minutes and be like hey we gotta have you move like this this isn't gonna work i'm like <laughs> i'm like yeah <laughs> so i move over three feet and now I'm like crooked, like playing crooked, like trying, I'm like, this sucks. Oh my gosh. The first hour and a half of the gig were like, a, I was just like, get me. I texted Jamie. I was like, get me out of this place. Like this place. I, look now, granted, they gave me a free meal. Like a lot of restaurants will give you a free meal and maybe even a free drink. A lot of places like bars will definitely give you a free drink or two. After about two hours of playing, I, or tech, so I started like 15, 20 minutes late. But it was also like a nightmare to like setting up, like having to finagle all this stuff. Like they put me in the str I don't know how, how they apparently have live music all the time there. And I don't know how, I don't know how they fit it. And it was also a weird vibe. It was so packed in there. And like, it just, it was just a weird, I feel like, I don't know. I feel like they needed like an Italian singer or something like that. Just a very strange vibe. Um, I don't know. I'm grateful for the opportunity. I don't know if I'll be back. I don't know. It's decent money, but it's also like... <laughs> but they gave me a free meal and the food was phenomenal. As a restaurant, phenomenal restaurant. I saw all the food coming out of the kitchen. So like every time somebody came out of the kitchen, they had to pass me. And every time somebody entered the restaurant, they had to pass me. It was a very strange location to have me. I was like literally in the center of the restaurant, but like in between the front door and in the, the, the kitchen door. It was crazy. The food looked phenomenal. And, I, and the food that I had was phenomenal. But it was a weird vibe for a gig. <laughs> Until the end, it started slowing down. And I started, but, but this was the cool part. This was the really cool part. Like people were completely indifferent about the music. I'd play anything, no, no claps, no nothing. Like which I don't really care, but it was just really hard to gauge. And I was like, okay, whatever. So I got to the point, I was like, all right, I could play Billy Joel or I could play a liver. I could play Billy Joel. I was like, okay, all right, I could play Billy Joel, or I could play Ed Sheeran, or I could play Oasis, and people don't care. So I played like a ton of my own music, and like really, I was like thinking of my set list for the concert. I was like just tr practicing things and trying things on my music because they didn't weren't responding whether it was like popular songs or not popular. They didn't just they didn't no response from the crowd. So I was like, forget it then. I'll, I'll, if nobody's responding, I'm just going to do my own stuff, jam. And I played a lot of my own music and it was cool because I got to practice and try new things with the songs and uh, I have a really cool new acoustic rendition of We Got It. So that was really cool to work out and just, it was, you know what? I made the most of it. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> oh my god.